I don't if I switch to my full screen it might it might break. Wait, let me go here. Oh that's not <gasps> that was old. You didn't see that, wait. There we go. <laughs> that was so old, oh my god. Um it might break if I don't have anything up. If I it might just show me like a big mirror. Um and that's not really what we want. So <laughs> Ah, well, how's everybody, how's everybody, how's it going? I said lots of the same thing there. I just said it twice. Um, I'm back. It's Saturday. It's a weekend. I love a good weekend stream. Um, flying out on Monday. That's, that's fun. Hopefully it's not too bad weather-wise. Crossing all my fingers and my toes. Woo, Saturday. Yeah. Weekend, baby. I love weekends. Been working on things. Where am I flying out to? Oh, just back out to school. I go to school across the country from where I live. <laughs> yeah, I li I'm in EST right now, and uh, I end up in PST. Which is annoying, because I have to layover, but... For the first time in like two years, I have a layover that's longer than one hour, which sounds awful because then you have to have a layover, but it's so scary when like your flight gets delayed and you're like, oh no, I'm going to miss my connection and then I don't get to go home today. Uh, so I uh, am excited about that. But How can you leave EST gang? I know EST gang is so good for, you guys are the best for streams. I'm going to be real. My PST buddies, I get out there. I'm like, damn, if I stream at 3, it's like 6 p.m. EST. That sucks. I gotta stream at like 12 to like stream at a normal time. <laughs> I have classes. I can't stream at 12. Actually, I could. My new schedule is like really good for streaming. Um, which is funny to say because normally who cares about, <laughs> about streaming in their schedule. But I like having morning classes. So it's more for that than for streaming. Um, let me open this up real quick. Who is pinging me? Okay, that's fine. You could be the meme of the guy with the gaming laptop, but with streaming. Good, okay. Uh, I don't know that one. What, which, which one are you talking about? Guy with the gaming laptop. I mean, I do stream on a laptop. That's the other really... Oh, it's so nice to be home. You guys have no idea. It's so nice to be home. My PC is at home, it's so quiet, I can like run a game and like run VTube Studio and OBS at the same time. It's beautiful. It's like a beautiful, wonderful world. I have so much storage, I can play any game. Oh, the lights go dim when he plugs it in, the fan is super loud. Oh, you weren't here for my airplane era. <laughs> I, I used to stream like my mic. I used to stream with, like, no mic, uh, except for my, like, laptop mic, and so it would just be, like, literally like I was on an airplane because it was so- it would be so loud every time. Not even a bit. That's- that was just- that was just my life. <laughs> my noise- <laughs> my noise canceling. Okay, well now I have the demon, so I mean it's like airplane, demon, I don't know which- it's so it's also so nice to be home because the demon just doesn't happen here. I don't know how it doesn't happen, but it doesn't happen here. Oh god, I don't remember what we were doing. I'm going to look into the demon very very closely next quarter. Okay, I've been saying that for probably about a year now. <laughs> it's so it's so annoying especially when I'm like cuz I've been uploading vods and stuff. And I've been like I have to edit all of them. I have to edit every single one, and it takes so much time just to get rid of the demon. I used to have something like that with my on my uh, hard drive clicking my old Toshiba laptop. Oh, I I think it's fun. I think audio stuff is kind of funny. I I don't really mind it, but I I am like continuously surprised that OBS doesn't like doesn't somehow just doesn't um catch my demon like it, it's it is a, it's definitely a software thing maybe obs is causing the demon i haven't even thought about that that's the one thing i maybe haven't thought about 
Um, maybe I should put... Is there germs over here? Maybe there's a lot of germs over here. I mean, there's germs down there, but there's nothing... Okay, this stuff is all... What is so germy in here? They put all the polluted dirt in here? Uh-oh, that's not good. Oh, Frankie is so germy. Whoa, Frankie's so germy. Are they sick? Go wash your hands, King. Go wash hands. Wait, can I even do that? I think audio is one of those things that once you really notice it, it bothers you. Maybe not with the mic, even. <laughs> The mic, like, I, I don't really mind too much audio stuff because, um, like, when I stream at home, I stream under my bed. I have a loft bed, and so, even though my, my room is also pretty small, but, like, my sound isolation is pretty decent because I have, like, essentially just, like, a bunch of audio, like, panels, because it's a, there's a mattress, like, right above me, um, but, but, um, yeah, I mean, my audio, like, I'm, it's pretty echoey where I am at school, but, you know, it's- the mic demon is a different- <laughs> a different beast. Can I have them disinfect themselves? No. Okay, I don't- I don't know how to fix that. You can tell the difference where something was recorded based on the main time? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. My welding professor liked to talk about that. He was like, the- the music of the universe is 60 hertz in America, or something, and I was like, okay. <laughs> Oh, what the heck? I don't know why all those were halted for a second. That was scary. Okay, so we got most stuff going. Oh, yeah, the pump? Oh, yes, we were really winning on that one. I don't remember what we were supposed to be doing next. I think I was saying, like, push out this way, right? And fix the food stuff or something. A different beast? Intermittent co-host. Uh... I don't remember what I was what I was doing. Oh, we were making a I was making a sick bay. But that is not all that I was doing. I think I wanted to expand farm stuff more. Oh yeah, once this was pumped out. I guess I don't even really have to wait for it to be pumped out, huh? I guess I could just kind of do that. <laughs> this poor room, I just keep expanding it every single time. I really need to make up my mind about how big it's gonna be. I'm sorry, what? Can't believe Damie killed me? You're streaming? Yeah, I'm streaming. I pinged. In, like, normal times? I know, I'm in EST. I'll try and do more morning streams in, uh... When I'm back at school. But, uh-oh. Um, is there an issue? No, I'll just have to do a man on that lock there. I didn't kill you, Umbra. I hope I didn't kill you. <laughs> I still use Twitter. Uh, I actually stopped using Twitter because um, I switched my browser, and I didn't have my login on the other browser, and so <laughs> and so then I uh, didn't use it. But now I am using it again, which is you know maybe bad, maybe good. I don't know. But I see I see some stuff. I don't think I can plant that in the door, but I'm gonna leave that for right now. Oh yeah. So this is this is chilling. People don't have to run the whole day, which is pretty good. And thermals... Oh yeah, we got thermal tiles that I can kind of block stuff off with. Um, I don't really know if we need to do that yet, but... Twitter's okay. I like... There's a lot of artists I like on there that aren't anywhere else. Well, because I don't have... I don't use Instagram. <laughs> I use Instagram. Lol. They also probably aren't on Instagram. What are they doing? Okay. I don't know how they managed to get up there. Wait, did they get stuck? No. Same thing, it's stuck down there. They could probably get up through that. They could probably figure it out. There we go. Hmm. I don't really know. Okay. After this, I'm gonna sweep this. I think. We gotta make some decisions about where to go, and what to do, and what we need to do. I think exploring is probably the best. I think power, I'll move here. 
But we can keep going over this way if we need more space for that. I don't really know. We're doing, like, pretty... I don't... There's no, like, issues within the thing that I have to fix, so... Uh, except for algae. How are we doing on algae? We got a lot of algae. How are we doing on oxygen? In the main areas, it's pretty decent. What's the goal of the game? Um, don't die. That's the first goal. And, uh, the second goal is... What the heck is this thing? Okay, wait a second. I built this and I don't know what it is. Um, the second goal is, like, you're trying to... You're trying to, like, get off the planet. Um, so you can, like, build rockets and stuff. But you start from nothing and you just, like, dig out dirt and you make, make stuff with it. Bleach stone. Oh, god damn it! we don't have any bleach stone. I didn't know we needed bleach stone. Uh, medical pack. How do I make a medical pack? Does this need a? Me oh, medical pack. Ooh, sl against slime lung. Okay. Nobody's gotten slime lung yet, so we're chilling. I've been very. <laughs> There's meteor showers happening. Okay, that's okay. Meat. Where's the meat? It's there. Okay. Something died, and we ate it. That's great. Um, I think maybe upgrading food might be a decent thing next. Oh, wait, no, we have to, like, get refined materials also. Ooh. Okay. Inefficiently produces refined re uh, materials from raw resources. Fires clay to produce ceramic. Okay, we probably need a rock crusher. We also probably need a power grid. <laughs> Wait, is there, like, higher grade wires I can make? Maybe I put the rock crusher just, like, over here. Do we think that's, like, a bad idea, a good idea? My building place is kind of all over. I, I don't really know what the purpose of many of these rooms are. Okay, deconstruct that. That's something that they can do. Okay, research complete. Uh, that's the one that we just did. Let me select more research first. I want to see, so one thing I do worry about is we're going to need chonkier wires. Yeah. Sound amplifiers. What? Smart battery. Ooh. Wait, that's good as well. I don't know why it's in smart sound amplifiers, but smart battery is really good. Is you can turn it on and off with somebody is texting me. Um, I think you can turn it on and off with automation stuff, but this advanced power regulation, <gasps> hydrogen gas into electrical power. Oh, these are, these are so f power transformer. <laughs> Let's go engineering mentioned. Okay. Sorry. Um, <laughs> I don't know. I think, I think we should do advanced power because I'm worried that we're going to overstart overloading some circuits if we do too much of this or maybe we do filtration what do you think what do we think gamers maybe we don't think <laughs> i think i think filtration because it's going to be faster and then we'll do the power because power is going to be the next thing so i mean we have nisbet who can get down here and research this natural gas geyser and if we want to build pipes we can build pipes and get down there if there's just, there's just slime lung everywhere okay, where's the least slime lungy place to enter probably through this side there's some there can i disinfect that or maybe we try and get down here i don't even know what this is only lacks advanced medical scare care skill we have one guy who can do that but a lot of polluted dirt too hmm okay well that's the thing that i can take care of let's make a storage bin for polluted dirt that's here in the polluted area so that we don't have to keep putting polluted dirt like in anywhere else yeah like raw like you know raw piles of polluted dirt maybe we should put those in the main area we still have half a cycle left. Maybe I, I'm a little worried about the food too, because I think 
most of our food is... Oh. Yeah, no, because it's from... We keep getting it from, like, animals. Well, that one's harvested. So that's not bad, but... I worry. I worry. We'll see. We'll do that. And then... We don't really need to worry about this water pumping it out, because we have this water getting pumped out. We could do... I don't want to go anywhere too hot either, so that's kind of a no-no zone. Up here is kind of okay. But... And I don't really want to make it a... I mean, I guess I could just... You know what? I guess we could just... Get a care package instead of a dupe. Wait, also, wait a second, those are different dupes than they were last time. Right? No, 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 they aren't. I lied. I think their names are just different. Ah, we really need, like, a cook. I really need a cook so bad. <laughs> At any given moment, a Max is viscerally, viscerally reliving ten different humiliating memories. That's sad. It's okay. I don't know about balm lilies. I don't know if we need a balm lily. Me <laughs> when I'm indecisive. <laughs> Is there still polluted oxygen over here? There's a lot of polluted oxygen over here, probably because of this stuff. Um, oh, filters, raw material, uh, organic material. Only this. I'm not gonna make it a priority six, but we are gonna get rid of this and that. I'm gonna get rid of it here too, I don't know. Uh, I think I can just sweep all these. Six. Sweep that at a six. Kinda like, damn, the colony's doing well. We guess we just, we're done. We're just gonna live here forever. <laughs> That's not really what we need to do though, is the thing. Um, Oh, no one is doing this. Hey guys, hey gamers, can we get a little coal over there? Is that priority six? Oh, maybe the batteries are... Yeah, the batteries are chilling, so I think that's why they're not doing anything. We are just kind of chilling, is the thing. This fridge is, uh... Getting full, too. Guess I could build another fridge. Yeah, power... Power is definitely our... Maybe I just get some digging stuff going. How are we doing on... Okay, oxygen over there is not a big deal. I guess I could build some oxygen masks. I haven't really thought about that yet. Because if I want them to just, like, go down here... I'm just worried about the germs. There's one singular germ. <laughs> Don't go over there. <laughs> Don't go near the one germ, and you'll be fine. There we go. Just gonna avoid the germ. I feel like we can kind of thread the needle a little bit. If I dig here, and then... Can I hit the gritty right now? Or like, ever? <laughs> am I... Like, am I allowed to hit the gritty? I don't know. Probably. Gritty Toggle. <laughs> oh, if I had Live 2D still. I don't have, I don't have a, uh, there's no way to get around this slime lung. I gotta dig through some of this slime lung. There's so much here. I guess I could go down, wait, I could go, no, because this is a better way, and there's like water here too. Grrr. Probably just smart to do this. We're gonna go first though. I mean, yeah, I think getting the natural gas is gonna be important. We'll go there, and then we'll do down. <laughs> through the water? Oh, they're gonna hate me so much. I can't- I can't have them go through the water. That's not- <laughs> I can't. They're gonna get hypothermia again. <laughs> okay, we'll go there. Instead. 
and then Gritty Wednesday. I took me a second there. I had to think about what day it was. I was like, uh, maybe? <laughs> Wait, why am I not going all the way down? Uh, down here. And then we'll go over here. And we can get our mushroom. Well, I actually already have a mushroom. But... We can check out this place. I don't really know what this place is. Because they can dig sort of over and... I mean, I guess we can get a potted plant. That's kind of cool. Maybe we can steal it. <clears throat> okay, that ladder is not... Can I, like, dig this tile? I don't know what this tile is. This tile. A dig? I guess I can't dig it. I don't know. Okay, optimal plan for getting into those places. That sounds good. We got some diggers. They want to do the digging. Uh... Why? Oh, I'm in an overlay. I'm in the germ overlay. Get out of here. <laughs> I was in that germ overlay for a long time. Sorry about that. <laughs> I was like, why is everything gray? Oh, look, they're already going. I love... well... Okay. They're very useful. The, the diggers. The people who dig. The people who mine. <laughs> people who perform a mining duty. <laughs> I'm not- I'm- you can't clip that, okay? I'm, I'm never gonna s Energy generation must be whack for an underground base. You don't want to combust anything, but you also don't have access to renewables. It's just like, nuclear or maybe geothermal if there's a large enough gradient. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, they do have coal generators in this game, which, you know, just with like, all the hyd- like, there's just hydrogen gas like floating around, there's natural gas, you know, maybe that's not the best idea for them, but they do it. Um, it works out. D mods, delete that. You're a mod, Umbra. <laughs> delete it. <laughs> Come on, this is a semi-family friendly stream. <gasps> Research complete. Oh, let's go. Filtration. Not that we need to filter things, but not yet. Then we'll do... Bah, 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 bah. I already forgot what I was going to say. Advanced power rally. I can't. I'm on mobile. Fine. All deleted. I'm I'm my own mod. I mean, I hopefully I'm my own mod. Wait, that's my alerts. Where is this? Highlight settings. Show mod icons. Show... Show... What? Why is it... Hello? Okay. One second. I'm a competent streamer. Oh, there's a toggle that I didn't... There, there we go. <laughs> it took me that long to delete it. <laughs> At that point, like, it's not even... Ah, oh, what did I do? I put my chat in the top of my... God damn it. Get out of there. Oh my god, OBS. Let me put the window down. My OBS is like, I have all of the windows, like, popped out. And so, like, sometimes if I move them around, they'll, like, go... They'll pop back in. And then they they mess up my my flow. Oh they oh it messed oh it messed up. It's fine. Okay, I'm normal. I'm normal again. Okay. Okay, crisis averted. <laughs> oh no god. I'm not trying to speed through everything. Although I mean I guess I could, but I like playing slow just in case somebody. Oh wait, what? No power. Oh. Just in case somebody dies. You know. Hey, they're sweeping that up. I was about to say, I really like how no one swept that up, but they actually... Okay. Hey, where are they sweep? Are they sweeping that to here? Get out of here. You cannot sweep those there. You cannot sweep those there. Attribute increase. How do they attribute increase when it's paused? <laughs> okay. There we go. There should be no containers that they can put it in. This should not be able to hold... Good. It can't hold dirt. <laughs> they can't eat dirt. Chat. Athletic skill. Oh, they're just picking up polluted water too, okay. It's like some of the complaints you have when living with roommates. Yeah, you can't put dirt in the fridge. 
God, I'm so glad my roommates are like wonderful, normal people. You found bunny suit, Damie? Oh yeah, the the bunny suit I drew. That's why. That's that's pretty much the only time you'll ever get Damie in other clothes is Lunar New Year. So when the Lunar New Year is a funny, hot animal, then you know. And everybody's drawing. I love how you can tell it's Lunar New Year when people just start posting, like, hot animal girls. That's my favorite. Okay, they're going- they're digging over here. Oh, look at that. They're digging so well. Oh. Well, the day's over. I don't post Damien art anywhere anymore. That's because I don't do a lot of, uh, colored art. And I feel like people don't like art that's just- black and white and lines, so. So I don't post it, but maybe I'm, maybe I'm wrong. This one piece of dirt is just still so hot. I don't know why. Like it's just this one dirt. It's 38 degrees Celsius. <gasps> Who's this little guy? Oh, it's a little hatchling. Wait, what? That's so cute. Oh my gosh, tiny baby! Oh, tiny baby. Maybe we should make a little hatch, uh... Uh, wait, can anybody wrangle? I think people can wrangle. Okay, you can't ranch. You can't ranch. Okay, I lied. No one can ranch, so we can't do that. Dang it, we can't have little tiny baby guys. That's sad. Is Frankie still incredibly germy? No, they're good. They- they figured it out. We got a germ issue still, but it's not like that big of an issue. Which I can appreciate. Let's see, how are we doing? Hey, We got some stuff! That's great. That's a lot of calories. It's added. Stress change. We're at zero. We're chilling. Disease. Lots of disease. On Frankie! What? Fra it's only Frankie! What? <laughs> there are 82,000 germs on only Frankie. That's... Okay, well... That's bad. Okay, travel time, there's a lot. Yeah, I know. That's on me, though. That's because I made them do that, and they're averaging it. Wait, why is Cal- Oh. Okay. He's like pig pen. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's like- it's like Spiders George. Sorry, he swallows one million spiders every night as st statistical outlier and should not have been counted. Visible germ clouds. They're fine now, though. Look, like... Okay, well, no, they're not actually fine. <gasps> Greater ranching. Oh no! I want them to ranch, but they don't want to ranch. Astronomy! <gasps> oh shoot, we could do that. We could do that. Or we could do that. Oh, man. I feel like... Oh, maybe we should build a skill scrubber, actually. Maybe that's the play. I think that's the play. Next. Underground astronomy? Uh, yeah, if you go up- if you go up high enough, you can actually get, like, to the ground. There's a top. <laughs> You're just kind of in the middle right now. Receives one... Oh, I don't know why it took me so long to read that. That's literally just a filter. <laughs> doing? Oh, skill scrubber is in utilities? No. Stations. Yeah. Okay, this is gonna go here, because it doesn't really matter, and it's never gonna be on, so. Is the atmosphere uninhabitable as well? Um, that's a good question, because, so like... It, it's like a mix in this game. There's stuff that, like, there's, like, little, um, there's a type of ore, I guess, that, like, produces oxygen. Um, obviously it's not everywhere, but that's how we have some, I mean, obviously our oxygen is being made from, like, algae, but there's some places also, like, in here, like, there's polluted oxygen here, so it's not totally uninhabitable, I want to say, but it's like, I think the atmosphere, like, as you go up is more just, like, vacuum and less gases. 
Down here is not great, though. I would like to give them something. But... I don't really know... The best. I'm gonna make this four over here. Eight, eight, four. <laughs> Do the other one first, please. Down here, like, there might be some oxygen, you know? Yeah, there's, like, breathable gas down here. For whatever reason. Oh, no one's planting these because the priority is not high enough. Lol. Meal woods. Are they space colonists? I think they're space colonists. I think we might have crashed. There is there is lore. Wait a second, where's the lore? I forget. Database? No, my log, yeah. Boot message. It's this type of thing. So yeah, they they are just space colonists. <laughs> if it's the latter, skill issue. <laughs> no, I think if they if they evolved there, it'd be kind of cool though. Oh, tragic. Yeah, they got trapped underground. I don't know. We're doing pretty. It's pretty awesome though. Like we got a lot of resources. I don't really. I feel like being on the surface would be harder. Maybe I'm just like. Maybe, I don't know. Oh, wow, that's already done. That's crazy. Okay, um... Okay, before we go and do this, who... I would like... someone to have... Ugh, we don't have a cook, though. Okay, so I can't unassign him, because I would give him improved farming, and then I would give him critter ranching. Um, I would get rid of this. Oh, Nisbet... Oh, yeah, Nisbet has a skill... A is pretty good. Catalina is also good. Maybe no one is bad. I think Nicola is the only one who, like, I gave something that I shouldn't, or quote-unquote shouldn't. But don't you want to know what spring is like on a different world? That's kind of beautiful. It's actually really beautiful. I would. I would like to know. I don't, I don't know if it would be like spring. <laughs> I don't know if spring would, would have the same kind of effect, but let's have Nisbet do crop tending. Rocks are the same color all year round. Yeah, <laughs> at least there's life. There's life on this planet, which is so exciting. That's like fun, you know? Like, I wish we could just go to like Jupiter and be like, oh man, there's some weird bugs here. Just like Earth bugs, but like they look, they're purple. <laughs> be awesome. Oh, Nisbet's doing all this digging. Oh wait, no, Nisbet's not. Nisbet is researching. Oh, okay, so we'll we'll pause on the research after we get the high power wires. Transformers are really cool because they can like actually limit stuff. Then <laughs> go to a dorm fridge. It's about the same thing. That's true. Yeah, just make a colony there. Just depends on what scale, you know. If it's a microbio or <laughs> macrobio. Yeah, I think we are doing pretty well. Okay, one thing I do want to check on is decor. Pretty bad. <laughs> These are bad. These are good. That has nothing planted in it. This is... I think if I put lights, it'll be better, but I don't really want to put lights until we have some sort of... I actually don't really know what there is for renewable energy. Like, cause I know, um, the thing with, uh, there's a decor, you can fail at decor. Oh yeah, cause if they have their morale is bad, then they get stressed out and then they like can't do things. So we've been at zero stress this whole time, except for when everybody was getting hypothermia and then it was bad. Um, can I deconstruct this? Oh, I can. <laughs> They're literally me. Well, that's why the skills are also important, because if you see these are the- this is their morale points. And if this- uh, if the red, um, like, if the red is bigger than the green, then they actually just add stress every cycle instead of decreasing stress. 
And yeah, if they're too stressed out, they can't do stuff, which, you know, is how most people are. <laughs> This is so exciting though, I don't... Advanced medical care is gonna take us a bit to get, but... It's cool. Cool as hell. What's in here? A locker? Can we just like... Oh no, you can only demolish it. We can't steal it. <laughs> I wanna steal it. Ooh, inspect! <gasps> oh, whoa! A hermetically sealed glass cabinet contains two spore kid seeds and a carefully penned note. Where's the note? Is this the note? Biobot Builder. Reboot an ambitious collaborative project spearheaded by Gravitas's bioengineering and robotics. If correctly rebuilt, it could save duplicate lives. Nanas admire. I am a subatomic particle, smaller than a speck of dust, flush from your gaze at the eyewash station. My love is like plutonium, gray and dull and unbearably heavy until I am near you. Every breath I burn with yearning unseen. Yes, I made Steve let me in so I could leave you this. I hope that's okay. Wait, that's so cute. What? <laughs> Wait, that is like the poetry I write, bro. <laughs> that's so crazy. My love is like plutonium. Gray and dull and unbearably heavy until I am near you. That's really sweet. Empty storage. Can't, whoa, we get resources? Oh, oh shit, oh shit. Wait, 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 actually cancel empty. We can inspect this too. A single page of a long printout remains legible. I can scan it and add it to my database. Well, the... I've been unable to shake the notion of the bow. The thought of its mechanics are too intriguing, and I can only dream of a mark such a device would make upon the world. Imagine, a source of inexhaustible energy. So many of humanity's problems could be solved with this one invention. Domestic energy, environmental pollution, the fuel wars. Huh. Oh my gosh, this is like Subnautica. Oh, I love that. I didn't realize they had lore up in here. Gravitas has been growing pretty rapidly since our first product hit the market. I just got to look at some of these new hires. They're practically babies, not quite what I was expecting. Then again, I've never had an opportunity to mentor someone before. It could be fun. I, whoa, okay. Discovered a laboratory full of dusty machinery. The vestiges of another colony's experiments, perhaps. It's unclear whether the apparatus is intended for biological experimentation or advanced mechatronics. Oh, hell yeah. Can I inspect the plant? No, I can't inspect the plant, bro. That's depressing. Okay, I can inspect this. The laws of thermodynamics. Hello, Mr. Krauss. I was emailing you after a little chat today to pass along something you might like to read. <laughs> Wait, these are just the laws of thermodynamics. I know you can neither be created nor destroyed. That's so funny. Wait, he's just... He's just... <laughs> He's just calling this guy out. If this is too complicated for you, you can come by to chat. I'd be thrilled to answer your questions. Winky face XOXO. <laughs> oh my god, the scientists are fighting. They're fighting. That's so funny. Simple wall clock. It's no longer ticking. Riz. <laughs> or like, you know how people will write research papers where they're like, Ah, uh, yes, other professor, uh, I think that you're so correct about that, but, like, they just are, like, they're just fighting in their research papers. That's what that reminds me of. It's cool. I like that you can find logs. I didn't realize that's something you could do. Well, now I want to go over to the other one and see what it's like. <laughs> I think getting the mushrooms would be good. I, I just, like, may, I don't know if we're ready. I don't know if we're ready for the mushrooms yet, because we need to get carbon dioxide in there. I mean, I guess this area we're digging out now could be where we grow the mushrooms. But, I don't know. It's kind of hard because, like, I can't put it up, because carbon dioxide doesn't... It's not like it floats above oxygen, so... What are they doing on oxygen, actually? Well, that's equilibri equilibrializing a little bit liberalizing liberal equilibrial 
Shine bugs are shine nymphs and shine bugs are cute. Do we have something to plant here? I thought they Oh yes, what is this? Uh uh what? Improves ambient decor but produces high quantities of zombie spores? Um, I don't think we're gonna plant- I don't think we're gonna plant that one there, actually. I think we're gonna plant a briar seed? <laughs> what? What are zombie spores? What is happening? Literally, what are zombie spores? I'm- I've never- I don't know if I want to know about that either, actually. I've decided. This is all carbon dioxide down here. We can- I mean, I can bottle it. I could build a pump, and then we could- just get a tank of carbon dioxide and like put it over here or something. That might be smart. Probably make my life easier. Damn, Catalina just like just pulling through over there. Poor thing. There's a little oxygen down there. <laughs> She's gonna be fine. She can she can go to where there's oxygen. It just it gets sticky if they get if they get trapped somewhere. Then that's kind of where it all goes to shit. What is up with the battery? One or more batteries have died. Eh, it's fine. Okay, let's let's make a plan to get some carbon dioxide. I think that's good. We're fine on coal right now. Um we're fine on food. Are we actually fine on coal? Yeah, we got ten tons of coal. I'm not too worried about the heat production of it. This thing is going. We're gonna stop that. Does a zombie spore imply that a fungus is able to resuscitate the dead and operate them like marionettes, or do other things have spores? I have no clue. I mean, we can actually look. You can look at stuff. Zombie spores. Oh, it's a disease. Parasitic brain fungus released by spore childs. Um, duplicants who touch the, or inhale the spores risk becoming infected and temporarily losing motor control. Yeah, so that seems bad. <laughs> it seems like what you said, that they can they get operated like puppets. Um, and they can't do work, and uh, we kind of need them to do work, so... Um, capital of them. There are bioweapons in this game? I think, yes, definitely. Um, or things that could be used as bioweapons. There's a lot of diseases. Do we have... What do we have for gas stuff? Okay, we don't have a uh, long commutes. Lol, I know. It's probably because of... Whoops, that's work time. Frankie. What is Frankie doing? Why is Fra Okay, well, whatever. That's fine. On average, it's not that bad. Construction supply was bad, yeah. When we build stuff and they go out here and they don't have oxygen, it takes a long time. They're setting up for multiplayer support, if so. <laughs> that would be cool. I would love to have mo I don't really know how multiplayer would work in this game. I think maybe if you had... I guess you could just, like, place stuff. Two people placing stuff. Oh, this is not done yet. Uh, I kind of need gas stuff, though. Which would be... Let me... Just giving someone's base horrible diseases. No! You gotta work together against the disease. You don't understand. Uh, where's the oxygen tank? That's what I'm looking for. I don't think I've ever done this before, but I could try that out. We need a tank. We need a tank to store oxygen. Actually, we need a tank to store carbon dioxide, but it's a big chonky boy. Where is he? What if we are the disease? <laughs> No! Where is... where... Where is this? HVAC? No. That's crazy. Cools the gas pipe through it. We are not at that level yet. Um... I am having a bit of a brain fart. Where are they? Where's the gas? This is like ranching. That's not like... Drinking juice increases duplicate morale. Hey, this might be cool to do at some point soon. I always just look at stuff and I'm like, oh yeah, I would love to research this. It looks cool. And then I forget about what I have to actually research. Where, where is it? Air systems? No. 
It's a big, chonky, like, tank. I thought we already had it, though. Maybe I'm, like, tripping out. It should be in gases. Do I have it already? Am I dumb? Wait, let me just look. I don't know why I'm doing this. Oxygen. No. Where's gas? What's happening? Um, canister filler can't. No, but it's not canisters. It's like a gas. You need browser tabs and bookmarks for the research tree. Oh God, yeah, I wish. Uh. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa okay. Well, <laughs> that, that was not right. Where is it? <gasps> whoa, home luxuries. Sorry. <laughs> it's, it's too exciting. <laughs> It's like a big pill-shaped tank. Am I- maybe I'm like just- this doesn't exist actually. That's- or they redesigned it. Two things that could really be possible. I could have sworn- because they have something maybe- with canister- no, because this is not- this is definitely not it is the thing. But you'd think that they would have- because like for fluids- is it a water heater? So like improved plumbing has this liquid reservoir. So then you would think improved ventilation would have it, but it doesn't. Hey, Damie. Hi, how's it going? I'm trying to be smart, but I can't find this thing that I'm looking for. I don't, maybe it's not in gases. I don't know. <laughs> Thermo regulator. Oh, here it is. Gas reservoir. Oh my god. It's orange. I thought it was gray. This thing. Yeah. Okay. Swag. Selected gas. Thermo sensor. Okay, it's gonna take us a while to get it, but that means that we can store. What are trying to find? Just a gas reservoir. <laughs> it was there. I just thought it was gray. I should try shapes.io. Oh, wait, let me see. Smart message. It was like a factory automated game. I will have to put that on my list. I'm going to Google it right now. So I remember. Ooh, ooh. Oh, it's just like a thing you can play online. Wait, that's so swag. I love that. Because everybody can do that. This game is like my little my little, uh, funny little engineering, um, fidget toy. <laughs> Sadly, online is only the demo. Oh, that's okay. This is like, why is Frankie? Frankie, what are you doing? What are you doing, Frankie? Oh, okay, they're algae. I thought they were picking up, like, polluted dirt, and I was like, we do not need to pick up the polluted dirt there, please. We really do need to cook, though, is the thing. Can I re-roll this? Wait, what if I just reject all? Why did I not do this a million times? <sighs> okay, I... Re I mean, I guess I could have just picked a balm lily seed, but maybe it'll... Three cycles, that's ah, fine. Frankie is balls of steel. Yeah, I really try to make them not walk in the water, because no matter what water they go in, even if it's hot, they always get hypothermia, so... But, um... Last stream, we had a lot of hypothermia action. I do want to make the fire poles too, that would be exciting. I'm really surprised at how much water was in here. Like, this water level rose a lot compared to what it was before. Pretty exciting. Um... I guess we could try and build, um, oh, I wanted to build a, a reservoir, or I wanted to build a pump system here. I think that would be a good idea. Let's do that too. Okay. This will be like our main pump. So if we need water anywhere, this pump will be the pump for us. I'm going to put it here. I'm gonna put it here. <laughs> and then we'll have it run up 
I love that you can build pipes through tiles. That's like the most awesome thing ever. I know it's that's kind of stupid, but okay. So we want a, a pipe here. I'm not going to connect it up to anything because we don't really need it anywhere yet. My mouse is not clicking. And I also don't want it to like connect to this place. Then it'll just go forever. Um... It would be nice to have like a little a little liquid reservoir somewhere as well. But I don't know if cuz I think we should have a main pump system from our reservoir just in case we need stuff. Just like, you know, we have a power system. But cuz I want to set up the laboratories. Cuz we have polluted water anyway. Hmm. 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 <laughs> Just put a cup of water on the desk. <laughs> oh, I wish I could do that. <laughs> It'd be beautiful. What if I built, like, something in this two-block high space? Now, I can't really do anything. I really kind of screwed myself over doing, like, this tall. That's sort of like what employers do at recruiting events. Wait, what? They put a cup, of, like, that everybody drinks from? <laughs> they all drink from the same cup. I'm what? <laughs> no, they don't. They don't do that, right? Uh, look, S. Okay, can I? Uh, maybe I can bookmark stuff because the next one we'll do is not that. The next one we'll do is improved plumbing. It's slightly easier than the HVAC one, but. Nah, it's fine. Like a plastic water bottle, not a cup. <laughs> I think it should be just one big cup. Like a, a trough that everybody just takes a sip out of if they need some water. Our cup. <laughs> They're going. They're going. Are we worried about slime lung there? Um, maybe. Did they pick up germs if they did that? Maybe they only pick up the germs. <laughs> okay. There's two there's two possibilities here. One bad one. They're getting germs every time they run up there. Run over this. But there's a sink up there, so hopefully that fixes that. But if I try to get rid of this so that they don't run over the germs, then maybe they're it only gives the germs when it explodes out when they like dig it, and then it would be bad for me to dig it. But I don't know which one is true. <laughs> I don't know if they're picking up germs right now or not. If they are, then I should dig it so that they stop picking up germs, but, um, I don't know. I, mean, I don't know. Yeah, that natural gas is looking pretty... pretty swanky. It's gonna be so, so hot for them, is the thing. <clears throat> Unrefrigerated food, hello? I guess we are kind of... Oh, it's just the power. So we are kind of coming up on needing a new refrigerator. Second one. That's a lot on the power load. I don't know if that's a good idea, actually. Maybe I just make a second one that's not powered. That would be kind of smart. Ideally, none of them will be powered. We put them in carbon dioxide. And we just say... Oh. <laughs> Create the underground sauna. Yeah, they're gonna get, like, burns, is the thing, um, trying to build this stuff, because the last time- Oh, and there's polluted water right there, it's gonna be so it's gonna be so sloppy. <laughs> it's, they're gonna go there, and they're gonna get poop all over them. Oh no, this- oh, this is gonna be unfortunate. Oh no, okay, we're gonna have to be really- I'm gonna have to think about that, that's- because we want to enter from here. Oh, oh, we also- but we need to build around it, too. And there's germs around it. I can build around some of it. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Um... Yeah. Let me... Think about this. 
So we definitely need... I think what we can do is we can do this. That. And we'll put a pump in there. There needs to be a door, also. <laughs> Probably. Not a liquid pump. Oops. A gas pump. Oops. I think that might need power. Probably does need power, which is also an issue. Sort of. Not... I mean... Oh, that's so annoying. I'm gonna make this priority four, just so they don't try and do it. Get out of here. Okay, we do need an air... An mechanized airlock? <clears throat> Is there like a thermally insulated airlock? <laughs> Maybe I just do this. I do like one airlock there, and then a second airlock, and a bunch of tiles between them. Oh my god, there's a plant there. <laughs> okay, we'll do this. We'll do three airlocks. <laughs> That you have to get through <laughs> to, to get in. This seems like, I don't know if that's like, if that does anything. I mean, two airlocks is like, okay. Like, uh, like an airlock like this, where like they have to go and close this one to get to this one. I d why would I do three? I'm gonna do two. That's dumb. <laughs> I can't build it there right now. Just imagine it's there. <laughs> oh, they're they're gonna do dumb shit when they're building this. I can I can already tell. There's uh, there's also not oxygen over there. He's getting stressed. Pay's getting, it's always pay. The hypothermia. Yup, it's always it's always water related. Always water related. Never never anything else. Well, I mean, I guess they also aren't aren't breathing very well, but that's. I built the ladder so that they can access the stuff they need to build without going in the... <laughs> without going in the water. And then they go and they go in the water anyway. Like, look at that! Why are you... <sighs> I can't do anything about it. They're just like that. They didn't need to do that. They could have stood on the ladder and did that. But they did this instead. Welcome, welcome to my life. <laughs> oh? <laughs> they can't even breathe! Oh, they're so dumb. How are we doing on the- how are we doing on the slime one? Okay, there's no slime one there. That's nice. Oh look, good, they're standing on the ladder. Good job, Catalina. I should make some oxygen masks. <laughs> it would make their travel times a lot less, I think. I also put a deodorizer, like, did I disable that? Yeah. Why? I don't know why I disabled that. And then just didn't do anything about it. How, how stinky is it? Kind of stinky. Wait, why is there so much carbon dioxide buildup? Probably because I can't get through the tiles now that there's tiles here. And dirt. Oh god! Oh, I did not think about that. Oh no. Oh, 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 okay. Wait a second. <laughs> oh, oh, you poor thing. Okay. Okay. Chill out a sec. Don't, don't do all this. Oh, you poor thing. Um, let's dig. Let's dig here. Oh, what's gonna be the easiest way to get the water out of here? Like, vent it this way, I guess. If there's not slime lung, there's slime lung over there. Gah! There's always slime lung over everywhere, bro. That should be okay. And then, like, if we dig this out, it 
should be easier and then I can build some ladders like oh it's not letting me build ladders high hi I don't think they can stand there but if I dig out here and they should definitely be able to stand there my mouse is revolting against me oh god <laughs> If I get some ladders, then they can dig out some more, and then that should be okay, though. As long as they're just not, like, going forward and doing this. Buried muckroot. It's drowning. Can a plant drown? I don't think that matters. Oh, this is getting... Getting annoying. Okay, uh, I guess I'll just prioritize the digging out of the stuff first before they dig out the other stuff. Yeah. And then I think that should make it if they build those before they do all this stuff then that should make their oh my god why did they go down there to dig it oh they're dumb oh no they're dumb i forgot oh no oh they're dumb i think it's okay where are they going okay well whatever so dumb. I really should put tile all the way down here so they don't... Well, slime lung. I don't know if getting rid of it makes it worse or better or something. I made the ladders so they can stand on the ladders. Okay, good. They're good. They're standing on the ladders. Jesus Christ. They're so goofy. Ah. Look how much food we have, though. That's awesome. Really going up in food. I like that. And then hopefully we get a cook <laughs> in 2.3 cycles. And if we don't, well, then, um, oops. And we'll figure it out. <laughs> we get a cook, we can skill wipe Nicola, and we can get him to maybe ranch or do something else. Then everybody's happy. I mean, not that he's not happy, he's just... He's doing what needs to be done. He's grinding it out. Guess we could also make a better kitchen. Kinda hype. Power's a little iffy right now, but I don't think we use that much, because we kind of only do oxygen stuff, so. Let's see. Oh my god, Frankie. Nicola has a lot of disease. Why are these people so germy? Why are they not washing their hands? What's up, guys? What's up with that? I have like a million wash basins just for that. Sorry, I'm eating a muffin. It's a good muffin. Hmm. 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 Oh, look at that. A power wire connected. Great. Having different grids would be nice. But I forget even how I would do that. I think it's just by having like one. They can both be connected to the same generator, but they just can't be connected to each other. Oh shoot, are we full on the refridge? On that little fridge? No, we're not full yet. <laughs> They're still going. How much stuff? How much stuff do we have? We have... Wait, we have so much meal lice, but we're not making lice loaf? 
but we're making mush bars instead. Wait, don't, don't make that. Make the other one first. I don't know how I can prioritize that. I don't know if I can prioritize that. I think the lice loaf is better. I'm not sure. Maybe they will make people a little happier. Oh god, I forgot about this whole ordeal. Oh, I need to be watching them for sure. <laughs> oh god. Water is just the bane of my existence. Like, at any given point. I mean, now that we have a polluted water thing, and now that we have a liquid filter, emptying, you know, if we... Hey, did I just build something? No, I didn't. Like, emptying the... The liquid, or the water, or like the polluted water is not going to be a big deal. But it certainly is going to be like just so annoying to have to have them like deal with water and stuff. Oh my god, don't fall. Jesus Christ. <laughs> but I think it should be okay because I'm going to. We only need like to be he this type of area if they can get the water level low enough we can just build tiles over it and forget about it maybe not the best way of thinking about it but that is the way that i'm thinking about it she's stuck she's not stuck right hey are you stuck uh i hope she's not stuck okay she might be stuck now um uh oh, she's trapped. Oh, we are. No, she still has oxygen. Whoa, whoa! I'm I was wor I'm worried. <laughs> I do not like it when dupes are trapped. Nobody likes it when dupes are trapped. That should be his priority six, and she'll be fine. She has resources. We can get out. But I need her to be able to breathe. Oh, okay, she can breathe. It's pretty bad over there, but she can breathe. She's good. Okay. Oof. Okay, so it's... It's okay. You know, it's not the best. But... If we build ladders over here... Okay, she got hyped, bro. Oh, stop getting hypothermia! They're so dumb. Well, that one really isn't her fault. That one's my, <laughs> that one's my fault. A little bit. Uh, we don't need to build it here. God damn it. Can you maybe not um be in the water while you actively have hypothermia? <laughs> the decor overlay. Sorry. Funny <laughs> to me. Well, I mean, hey, if we're being realistic about things, it's about to get very hot where they're going. So, you know. Not that that's gonna like fix the fact that she has hypothermia, but like it's certainly not gonna be as much of a detriment. Okay, never mind. God damn it. The water. I think the. Uh... Is that a moppable level of water? It's like a kid going from the hot tub to the pool and back and forth. Yeah! It's like taking a cold shower, you know, after. Okay. Okay. Hold up a second. Get rid of this. And then I think we might just be able to mop this. I'm not entirely sure, but I think it might be moppable. Oh boy. Oh, she is just going for it. Oh, she just let out. Okay. Um, that is bad. Uh, you did a- you did a thing. My dear sweet dupe. You did do a thing. And that was maybe not the best thing you could have done. Oh god. Okay. Let me think about this. This is natural gas. Is it denser than oxygen? Let's see. This is important. I am worried this is just going to flood my entire base if we don't close it. What's the thing that looks like cinnamon in the box? This? This is um, a natural gas geyser. 
So it's going to produce natural gas, which like we can use to make fuel or uh, whatever. But if the gas it's producing, because, well, she just opened it. So that little spot right there, it's a little hard to see because there's a door, but we don't want to build a door there. That was enclosed and now it is not enclosed. And that's going to leak crazy in terms of temperature. And um, we don't want that. No, I don't want the priority six, that's priority five. The rest of this should be priority five, though. Because it's very hot natural gas. And wait, if we look at the temperature overlay, it itself is 99 degrees Celsius. <laughs> it's got, it's, the gas it's producing isn't bad, but I think if I remember correctly, once it probably makes it easier to burn. Yeah. Yeah, I don't actually know about it might be it might be more efficient. I would not be surprised if this game was like, oh, more efficient to pump like hot gases into gas generators and stuff. Um but oh wait, I need to see. Because if it is I mean we gotta close it up either way. But if the Oh, there's so many cool vents, different kind of uh, geysers you can have. If the gas is more or less uh I guess elements maybe? Yeah, gases. More or less dense than oxygen. Specific heat, not density though. That's interesting. Um, does it really not tell me the density? I guess maybe not. What if this game was called Freaks Not Included and well, you know. I I don't know if like cuz you know how like cult of the lamb <laughs> I feel like they could who got oh I thought somebody got sick with something that wasn't hypothermia I feel like you could have that in this game okay this um um what are you doing Oh getting the stuff to supply the construction tile please Thank you my dear it's not um that's not what I want you to do Oh, I didn't put it at six. Uh, actually, I'm gonna put it at seven. Yeah, right now. I'm not having anything else. Please. I'm not paying attention to anybody else. I really hope they're doing fine. I don't even know where they are. Nisbet's there. Frankie's there. Nicola's there. Catalina's doing something. Is that everybody? One, two, three, four. Yes. Oh god, it's taking so long! It's not that big of a deal, but also it's that big of a deal. Because I really don't want this whole area to be flooded with natural gas, and it produces a lot of natural gas as a thing. Oh my god! Put more sandstone in there quickly, please! It's getting so red! Oh, there's already so much carbon dioxide down there! Oh, it's gonna be so impossible to deal with. Oh god, I didn't even think about that. Oh god. Oh my god, don't- what are you doing? You're dumb. Do this right now. Eight. <laughs> Please. Don't keep supplying things. <laughs> Everyone's running down to do this one thing. They're like, Please, God. Oh my God, why are they building that one? They're so dumb. Build the- Build this one. Is it not? Is it not reachable? Is that why? Can they not reach it? Uh, build one here. I don't care. Oh my god. Please. Oh, there's so much natural gas, bro. Oh my god. I'm gonna lose my mind. No, they can build it. They just haven't been building it. So dumb. Oh, god bless. Okay. We're gonna have to, like... Get these guys some smart training. Okay. Hold on a second. They're just supplying things. Okay. This doesn't matter. This right now doesn't matter. I mean, it kind of matters, but like not that much. <laughs> okay, I just want to get these things out of my face. There we go. 
Okay. We need to put the priority of most of these low so that we can build the ones that are going to keep the gas in first. Oh, there's so much natural gas. I'm, I'm assuming it's... It seems like it's heavier than oxygen. Because polluted oxygen is, is not... Um, is not an issue. Oh, wait, okay, now we can build the... Yeah, so if we build, like, a manual airlock here, for example, and then we do an insulated tile there. We put the priority on those up. Then we should be able to, like, work in here and not have it um, backfire on us terribly by letting out <laughs> kilograms of natural gas into our oxygen area. Oh! Oh, Pei, are you okay? You gotta move, babe. That was- you walked into a tile that just began existing, and you probably don't know how to- Uh-oh, she might be stuck. Okay, um... <laughs> They're so dumb. Don't build this right now. You need to move. I don't even know if it's possible for her to move. Okay, good. I was really worried she was, like, stuck, stuck. But it's okay. She was not homestuck. There we go. No one's having a fun time. Actually, Pei is just not having a fun time. <laughs> They're going. It's okay. She has hypothermia. She does not have hypothermia. Major eye irritation. Oh, in contact with slime lung germs, bruh. Oh. <laughs> okay. Let me think about this. If I give them, is there like a suit they can wear? There might be like a hazmat suit sort of something. Wait, the natural gas is not escaping. Maybe. I don't think so. I think it's being squished by the carbon dioxide. Praying. Praying that the carbon dioxide squishes it. Because we can, like, pump it out. We can, like, filter it. But, like... I actually also don't know. So these are sandstone ones. We might have to replace these with, like, better ones at some point. But I think it's okay. For now. I think they'll be fine. I think the, hypother the hypothermia goes away. Crazy thing to say, but it does. Um, mopping this would probably make them happier as well, but, you know. If they want to do that. Okay. <laughs> These poor guys. <laughs> okay, they're leaving. They're leaving. What's happening? happening babe what's she doing why are you standing there and not doing okay uh they're so tragic uh oh uh oh okay um oh my god oh it's less dense than carbon dioxide no oh it's less dense than carbon dioxide we're gonna have to f pump all of it out of here oh my god God, no. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's so unfortunate. Well. It'll be a fun way to test our gas filters. <laughs> um. That is uh, very interesting. Oh, the other thing we have to be careful about is temperature of gases, so if it gets too hot, then we don't want to do that either. Oh, I could do a gas bridge for this, or, um, a liquid bridge. It's a different thing, but... I do liquid bridge over this so it doesn't run into that. That'd be nice. But uh, this is the main... I want this to be the main liquid pipe, so that will be the main liquid pipe at some point. Um... I guess I could do, also do, like, a cutoff valve. 
So like if we have an input, uh, like a pipe can be an input or an output pipe. It's not like we have a directional pipe. So I could put this. Wait, which one is in? In is this one, yeah. Must be built in unoccupied space. Oh, it has to be built like here. That's kind of dumb. Well, it's not that dumb. It'd probably be a good idea to have that be there. Just thinking ahead. I won't connect it up yet, just until this is done. Oh, it's almost- it is almost done pumping. I mean, we'll have to do this a little bit too, but... You know. Oh, the natural gas is gonna make me... That's pretty unfortunate. It still seems like polluted oxygen is... You know... Less dense, but it's not stopping it, which is more of the problem. Thank god I built all this airlock stuff, though. I mean, so, you know. Nisbet, athletics. Oh, it's full. I guess we'll have to get some more. We need another deep so... We need another deep so bad. I'm kidding. We don't... We don't need another dupe that bad. But it'd be nice to have another dupe. I'm gonna build a refrigerator there, I don't care. If it blows up the circuit, then we'll fix the circuit. <laughs> oh. Hey, we got some stuff. Hey! All on meal lice, look at that. Nobody is sweeping these, that's unfortunate, but it's fine. Yeah, the germs are not, not great. I don't know what kind of germs they are. I'm assuming they're slime, some of them are slime lung. Yeah, I think it, I think slime lung happens when you dig the slime lung. So I'm glad we didn't dig it here because that just would have been like not as great. I'm just looking. I don't see any green. I see yellow. <laughs> Oh my god! Jesus Christ! What the f- Okay. Okay, so, um... Wow. Uh... Oh my god, it's so yellow. Uh, um, 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 let's build a deodorizer in there. Let me, okay, so a deodorizer uses sand to filter polluted oxygen from the air. Can I build them on top of ladders? Oops. If I can build them on top of ladders, our, my life is awesome. If I can't... It, why can I click my mouse? Thank you. <gasps> I can. Okay, what if I just put like six? <laughs> I'm gonna put this many. Four. Uh-oh. That sucks. Uh, I mean, I guess I could put airflow tiles? Actual question is there's sex in this game. Um, well, let me check. Uh, I don't think so. No. Because you print people. They don't have kids. I think. Unless there's a part of this game- What do you mean, let me check? Well, there's a bed. I didn't know if that was like, oh, well, yeah, yeah. Let me check, you know, just in case. <laughs> Let me check if there's a research upgrade for sex. Real quick, okay? <laughs> it's very important to me. Just in case. Okay. Um, fuck, where do I want to put these? They need to be, like, down here. 
Oh, mesh tile. Wait, does not obstruct liquid or gas flow. That's what we need. Oh, we can just put them like here then. I'm just worried if we put them like to, um, like if, if I make a line of stuff and then it like just screws over my, there's no point to like building a thing, you know. That was the least sentence I ever said. It would ruin my reservoir. That's what I was trying to say. They need to have power. <laughs> go up through the floor. And then over here. And, whoops. Not what I wanted to do. That's a short circuit. Um, I haven't decided how to do the second power grid. Maybe I'll make a power grid for oxygen stuff. Or maybe I should make a power grid for only oxygen stuff, and then a power grid for everything else. Wait, what? Invalid construction location. Oh, no, that's fine. And then it's fine. Yeah, I think we should have a power grid for oxygen, one for everything else. So that means getting rid of our power stuff. Um, what does that actually mean? So... That means we need to have, like, two main lines, I guess? Uh, it's kind of hard because we only have one ladder, <laughs> which is kind of dumb now that I'm thinking about it. We kind of do need another main ladder. It would probably be over here. It's a little germy, but it's not too germy. Yeah, I think this would be where the second main ladder is. <sighs> trying to think. How would I do this? Because I want the batteries to connect to both of them, and I want the generator to connect to both of them. I don't know if this is still... Also, I'll have to check if that actually is picking up liquid still. Because <clears throat> I don't want it to do that if it's not. So we need to have this floor and this floor on one. And then... Um, we can have the... I guess I can run through the floor. Two plus two? Uh, okay, wait a second, let me think about this one. Um... Well, it's 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1, and so that would be 4. Hell yeah. Good question. <laughs> He's insane. I know. I'm a, I'm a mechanical engineer, what can I say? Gotta kind of do that stuff on the daily. You get used to it, you know? I think I figured it out. Okay. So it's gonna be like this. <laughs> and then it's gonna be like this. So we're gonna do that and that. Why do I still have a manual generator? I guess just in case. That. Wait. Yeah. I'm learning. And that. Uh-huh. And then... Need a mechanical engineer to whisk me away. Wink. Most mechanical engineers are not, I know I know what you're like implying, but most mechanical engineers are so are so not so not Damie Core. I'm like Oh, you don't even know. Uh <laughs> Um I'm just gonna deconstruct, like, all of this, I guess? The manual generator I should also deconstruct and, like, figure it out. Most mechies are pretty chill. Oh, I feel the opposite way. Chemies? Um... I know any chem engineering people? I don't actually know if I even know any chem engineering people. I know EE's couple. Um, yeah, I don't know. 
I feel like most of the people I know in Meki are kind of, um... <laughs> well, they're, like, chill. They're just not very interesting, I guess. Sorry if you're a Meki and you're out there. I'm sure you are the good Meki, okay? Don't worry about it. EEs are a bit mixed. EEs are like Emmys, um, to me. They're both kind of in the same, like, space for... Ooh, a skill point. Oh, yes, wait, that's good. Are they still... Okay. Yeah, I think... Okay, hold up. Now, how are we looking on the power? So this... No power consumers. Yeah, so they need to build this line. But the other line still needs to exist. It just needs to have wire bridges. Are wire bridges allowed to be built in, like, the background? That's the only thing. If I'm not allowed to build them in the background? I think I am. Yeah. <laughs> We're just gonna hop over... These. is kind of stupid but like don't worry about it and hop over that and then we're gonna go like this and then that's gonna get deconstructed so it doesn't really matter but it would be on the same thing and then this wait i don't oh yeah no i do and then this so the generator is powering both of them eh Right now, the food is still on the other one, but this one would go up. Can I build wires over pipes? I think I can. I think I can, and then that's okay. I don't. I just don't know if I can build wires over pipes. I think I can, though. Otherwise, it would be like, don't. You can't build that there. Okay, I'm going to uh, deconstruct this one. so many things on there. No power wire connected, building is disabled, and deconstructed. Fuck your whole life. But like, only for the deodorizer. Engineers are so interesting though. Like, it's such a weird space to be in. To have, you know, so much like math and stuff required of you. People just kind of, like, turn into robots a little bit, I think. Hey, is there... Oh, there's a lot of carbon dioxide over there. That's not good. Maybe I should build an algae thing. Sometimes it feels like they're not real people. Yeah, exactly. This should not be here either. Deconstruct that. I thought the water reservoir was going to be a different place. Look how happy everyone is when they're just <laughs> working in the base and not working out in the real world. The, the wild. I was gonna say real world, and I was like, that's not true. Whoever's bed this is, is pretty germy. God, just looking over there. There's so much germs over there. But we gotta fix this power thing first before we fix that. Cause we need oxygen. You're being around non-engineers too. Yeah, I think like most of the um, people I know who are like non-engineers are pretty cool. But there are some liberal studies people, or like uh, not liberal studies, liberal sciences people, liberal arts people, whatever, um, who <laughs> like because I have an English major roommate and. There, there are people there who are also a different kind of bad. <laughs> so it's like, it's not like lesser of two evils, but it also kind of is in a little way. Um, I kind of want to move this over there. I don't think it needs to be here. I think it should be right next to the coal. Does this output carbon dioxide? Produces carbon dioxide. That's why there's carbon dioxide there. That would do it. No 
Oh god, who's down? Why were you down there? Well, whatever. English majors are freaks! That's why I'm an English minor. Business majors? Oh yeah, business majors are... Business majors are a different world. I don't even know. I mean, I have friends who are business majors, and I'm just like, how do you... How do you do that? You know? Like, how is that your thing? Makes you jealous sometimes? They're like, yeah, I don't have any classes on Fridays. And I'm like, what? <laughs> like, I always have classes every day of the week. At all times of the day. But, no, it's like, oh god, they're gonna go into the germ sphere. Don't open the door too much, there's so many germs in there. Oh no, the germs are, are... Well, we'll figure it out. <laughs> or labs that start at 7? Why are midnight labs a thing? You have midnight labs? Ugh. I don't have midnight labs. I have like, um... I have a lab that ends at like 9, but... You know, not midnight. Jesus, that's crazy. There's a lot of germs that's, that are getting out, I'm realizing. But I think we'll be okay. Oh, not a minute, it gets out at 9. Oh yeah, I had that. I had that my, um... I have a lecture that's 7 to 9 p.m. I had a... Or no, 6 to 9. I had a, a lab, my, like, manufacturing lab was from 6 to 9. And I was like, why... Like, no one can even eat dinner. <laughs> like... Like, what, what... When are you supposed to have a life? Are you, why, why are you going to lab at 6 to 9? I guess there are some people who like doing that. Why can't stuff be in the morning? I know, right? Oh my god, she's going into the... The germ sphere. God. Right? Food, yeah. I don't know. I don't know how... I don't know why professors would do that either. They, like, they have to get home. They gotta commute, some people, you know? No resources yet, water. I wonder if there's a legitimate, like, technique in this game for producing oxygen that's just, like, having a bunch of polluted water. Because this is, this does produce oxygen. There didn't used to be oxygen in there. Nobody wants to be there. I certainly don't want to be there. Although, um... I did hypothermia. Bro, get out of the water. You literally don't need to be in the water. I had a... My, my lab at... <laughs> my lab at 6 to 9, I had to build, like, an air motor. And we were supposed to manufacture, like, a bunch of them. And... Yeah, no one was too pleased about that. I think it's solely because someone has a day job or they're allowing it. Yeah, I don't know. That's cool. Yeah, we had to test it, but I, like, technically, like, if your air motor didn't work, you failed the class or something, but <laughs> I got too scared because I thought mine was going to explode, even though I saw, like, a bunch of people who didn't whose theirs didn't explode, and so I never actually technically tested mine, but don't tell the um, professor that. He was cool. He is a cool guy. <laughs> mine would've worked. I, I think I have it somewhere. It, like... It, uh... There's a lot of people from my school who will just, like, have them around. Their desks and stuff at their work, and I think it's funny. Motor labs are stressful. Yeah, they are. Well, I just don't- I don't like the idea that, like, oh my god, there's so many germs now. I don't like the idea that you can just blow something up. Because it's, like, hydraulics. Oh, it's not strained. Hmm. Maybe I was just coping. Potential load. There's a lot of potential load, but... I mean, it was- it was really cool. I- I really liked it because, like, uh, my group of people- so it was kind of hard because, like, we split up into, like, self-assigned groups to pick different stuff that we had to manufacture, and 
like we were making um the the pistons out of like delrin so i just got to like sit on a i basically went and put a taper on all of them or not a taper chamfers on the ends of all of them like on the lathe and then i just went and drilled holes in them and that was like the easiest thing ever and i just had to do like 20 of them it was it was great so oh, these are hard i don't want to give them anything that would give them too much stress so i guess i'm gonna wait on them advanced medical care oh my gosh it's gonna give him so much stress i don't have enough morale for that is there anybody who can pick a thing that they want to do that doesn't give them too much stress sure aesthetic design lathes are so fun but so scary i totally agree they're really fun improve construction we'll do that super hard digging we don't need right now made a wooden christmas tree once a lot of ours were metal stuff i felt so bad though because like for this production one we had to produce stuff and like you were basically responsible for one part so you know you weren't it wasn't like you were building the entire um is he socializing with the battery <laughs> okay i don't know pump not in liquid okay we've done it i will deconstruct that we'll mop up this um what was i saying oh uh yeah so we had to build like each one part and i had to do the other thing i had to do was i had to take these i think i was doing i think i was doing flywheels and so my job was to like face all of the flywheels on the lathe and cut the like get them down to the correct size because they were like stock cut off on a on a cold saw or something and i was like oh i can do this i'm just like gonna go and like pump through 20 of these and like get a little efficient way of doing it you know like knock it in but i was like i realized like halfway through that i i hadn't like seated all of them correctly or seated i wasn't seating all of them correctly like all the time and so they were all like they were all like a couple, you know, a, not a couple thou, like, oh god, somebody got food poisoning. Um, I think I can get something that fixes food poisoning. Can I make one? It doesn't have power. Um, but yeah, I felt really bad, because I was like, oh man, like, I did that. <laughs> I fucked it up. But it was because the, the lathe that I was on, too, just like it's um you know how you can like lock the lathe like in place where you want it to like cut it it's just like didn't lock and so it it um it would just like it, it wasn't saying the correct cut distance and all that so <gasps> cooking yes let's go let's go let's go baby oh my god seven cuisine and they can do hard digging holy moly oh that's great oh my god we're going with ellie let's go welcome in instantaneously i don't even care i'm gonna give you a hat can i give you a hat can we give you a hat hard digging no 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 don't worry about that you get a skill point oh we are going in grilling let's go the mechie equivalent of the voltmeter being broken oh, that's so real grilling and then you get to take off your hat you get to wear the doctor hat sir oh he's so hyped let's go doctor time okay um time to do priorities you do not have to cook anymore uh there we go Lab equipment is so hit and miss because people break things. They just put it back and grab another one to break. It's so true. In my EE lab, my circuit theory lab, last order, we had resistor boxes, right? And like, you know, inductor boxes and stuff. And one of ours had like 100 ohms of resistance. And it just like wasn't supposed to have any resistance just because our stuff was so old. 
Like, oh my god. That was so bad. Let's go! Let's go, everybody! Let's go! Oh, I'm so hyped. And the HVAC was completed! Yes! I love substitution boxes. They were really fun. They were really cute. Did it have more circuits labs? Oh yeah. No, that's so real. Circuits are actually pretty fun. I had a pretty decent... Um, I had a pretty decent professor. Or a lab instructor. And, you know, it was, it was pretty good because of that. But there were definitely people who had a hard time with that lab because it was like... Our lab manual is really old and outdated. And if your professor didn't teach, then like you were kind of screwed. <laughs> but if our labs are online or have a heavy software component. Whoa, that's interesting. Ours is very hands on, but I'm out of school that like sells itself for being very hands on. So I hope they were on old books. You have a story. Oh, do tell. Sorry, she's going to express herself. No, she's going to cook. Let's go. Let her cook. There's the water. Oh, this water. Actually, this needs to be a little higher priority, ironically. Because we want to put power stuff in there. Oh, so hype. Oh, look, he's going. What are they waiting for? I don't know, is she gonna get cured in like a couple cycles or like what's the deal? Uh slime no 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 where's the where's the sicky bit? Food poisoning. Uh 1.5 cycles. Oh yeah, we can definitely try out this chew tablet. Uh-oh, uh-oh, can you close the door, my love, my my darling? Oh, they are not. Oh my god, it's so germy. We're gonna have to put deodorizer in there too. God damn it, bro. But we can we can figure out a much better power grid now that we have gotten this sort of water deal sorted out. My great uncle used to teach as an adjunct at the university I attend. He used to work on the base or on base, and that was pre-retirement, post-government job type of position. He retired around 2014, and you were getting into electronics, so he gave you a lot of old textbooks. Oh, that's cool. I assume they're like, one of the things that get, really gets me in ME, it, people love to say is they're like, well, you know, fluid dynamics hasn't changed much in the past 50 years, so you can read whatever textbook you want. And I'm like, mmm, but some of them were not written very well. Oh, you had one of them, one of your textbooks last semester was one of those books. My casting professor gave us, he had a stack of these books that were for, from like 1894 that were like about how to cast metal and he was like hey does anybody want these we're supposed to give them out for the department and i'm like dude they're so <laughs> they're so old <laughs> no one needs those got to take the course with the professor that wrote the book oh wait that's so good but also sometimes really bad it's like a blessing and a curse because like sometimes the professor that wrote the book just like doesn't like know what they're talking about or like no not not know what they're talking about but like doesn't like are like it's like oh well i wrote the book so like i like know too much you know it's of the course back to front from the book yeah you know it's kind of like my um my my philosophy with it is like if you're the professor that wrote the book right no fabrication's cued. Wait, do we- can I- did I- wait. Sorry. I'm, I'll finish the thought. I just need to see if- Oh, take medicine. Can you do that? I don't know what she- um... Is she doing that? Maybe she is, I don't know. But if you're the professor who wrote the book and you're teaching the class, like, if the book is bad, someone should be able to tell you the book is bad, like, and you understand that. 
That's my big thing. Oh shit, cured a food poisoning. We did it. We got an achievement for that. Cure a sick duplicate of disease. No way. He's cool. He teaches in that old way. He's from the Polish SSR initially, so he's really cool. Oh, that is cool. All my professors are pretty mid all the time, so really I'm just in, like, a massive copium phase where I, uh, can't really do too much about, about it. Okay, we need to get, we need to get some of these going. Wait, are these even active? No, they're not even active. I'd like them to be active though, please, and thank you. We're going. Building entombment? Oh. Well, don't entombment. <laughs> oh god, <laughs> I did that. <laughs> Ugh, all this stuff. Building this is going to be rough. This actually needs to be deconstructed, unfortunately. Yeah, that's going to be a struggle bus. Oh my god, look how far the natural gas has gone up. It's so up there. Oh, and all the carbon dioxide is down here. Oh, bro. Oh, that's so fucked. Um, okay guys. We need to build the st don't stand in the doorway. Oh god. Well, okay. Who cares? <laughs> You're definitely letting the natural gas out. Don't stand in the doorway. Oh my god. I was okay with it for two seconds. You need to move inside the doorway, or you need to... <laughs> Honestly, that's the truth. My professors are something else this, this semester. Half are good, and the other half aren't. One of them doesn't grade by a rubric, it's just on a whim. Oh no. That's worse. I mean, mine do grade... Oh my god, this natural gas issue is so bad. We're gonna have to pump all this out at some point. Anyway. Um... But yeah, mine, mine do great on rubrics, but they're they're just their teaching philosophies are just bad. <laughs> Asked her about a rubric and said she didn't know the word. Oh, that is really bad. <laughs> I'm gonna add a second airlock. Actually, this is very important. I don't care anymore. Travel time be damned. I do not want natural gas in my base right now. There's just like a little bit here. That's kind of cute. I think at the end of this cycle, I'll start setting stuff up so that we can fix all the power and stuff, but we still kind of, it's kind of scuffed because we're going to need to like build it redundantly. And then, you know, get rid of the other stuff once we get the new stuff in. Wish more teachers would do recitations. I don't understand why that's not common. Hmm. What do you what do you define as a recitation? Because I've had one recitation, and it was not the um. It was it was okay. It was like it was like another just like a class type beat. I actually didn't even realize it was a recitation. <laughs> Because it was good. those classes are better because you have an oper. Oh wait, wait. So what is a what is a recitation? Oh shit! I didn't give them a. Oh, I didn't give them a bed. Oh, that's that's sad. I'm sorry, Ellie. Like a class, but you're working on problems. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that is what I thought. Look at this, it's so deodorized. I guess I just need to put some mesh tiles up there. Airflow tiles. We'll do that. Let's put like three. And we'll turn off the outside ones. Uh, I, yeah. I'll, I'll have to disable the buildings just cause um, I could, I wanna put a power switch over there so that I can just automate it 
and like turn it off in the automation overlay, which is my favorite overlay of all time. But we can't get there yet because we don't have Rock Crusher and stuff. Cycle 40. Oh, we added a lot. Or we removed a lot, but we harvested a lot, so we're still in the green. When I look over there. Domesticated critters, travel time is a lot, mopping took a lot, yeah. And I have someone giving you feedback while doing it, it's not a subset for doing P-sets on your own, but I feel like it's more, you learn more than when you, yeah, no, I totally agree. I think that recitations are, oh god, oopsies. They're good, they're good. I think, oh, stupid doofus, get out of here. There's no food here. I'm just waking up my guys. It's really unfortunate. Uh, the worst is when they want us to do active learning. My, uh... My professors... Wait, does this take power the whole time? Or not? I feel like it doesn't. Um, my professors are kind of like... They don't have time, because we're on a quarter system. So, like, they don't have time to do... Oh, my God. They don't have time to do stuff like that in class, which is really ass. But it's kind of like, what can you do about it? And the answer is kind of nothing. <laughs> Active learning is fine. Sometimes it's just often poorly implemented. I don't even know what active learning like would be. Like just like sitting and listening <laughs> is that the active learning or like oh making whoa making students present every lecture oh my classes could not do that people would be too dumb sorry they not too dumb they would not know how to do that <laughs> whoops people would not learn anything people reading from slides without adding anything yeah I mean, I I like that for finals, because I'm insane. I like the idea of uh, verbal, oral, oral finals, because um, some math professors want to do that, but pretty much only enables attention speaking, every class being a discussion sort of thing. Oh, that seems like... I feel like that wouldn't work for most subjects is the thing, though. Where's furniture? Uh, here we go, mesh table. Oh, enables attention seeking. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Yeah, that makes more sense. I was like, what? <laughs> it doesn't work. Yeah. It's so painful. I would be mad. Save me. Oh, that sounds so bad. I mean, I do that. I guess I do that when I stream, but like, I'm cool about it, so get wrecked. I also don't do it for people who pay money for an education, so. <laughs> How are we doing on oxygen? Kind of all over the place. Not a lot in there. Lots of polluted oxygen sort of everywhere. Different though, you're learning by explaining it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. I tell people, I'm like, you should teach if you want to learn well. And they're like, what? And I'm like, yeah, just teach other people. Like, I can't do that. I'm like, skill issue. Do it scared. I think I want to make, I think I want to make a second ladder up this way. Tutoring taught me a ton. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Teaches you a ton about yourself as well, not even just like, you know, other people. I think I'll just build a ladder up from here, like this. The same block, yeah. Is that a good idea? Eh, well, it's an idea. Carbon dioxide up there, but like, who cares? <laughs> 
we'll figure it out. It'll, it, it's not gonna float down, but we'll put some mesh tiles in there and we'll make it work. I just can't put mesh tiles down here because then that would be bad. Um, for hopefully obvious reasons. Amazing the people that do it well and can think of their feet. <laughs> I'm good? Oh my gosh, you're so niceies. I try to be good. Well, what I try to do is, like, I try to explain it in a way that's, like, that makes sense. Oh, think on their feet. Got it, got it, got it. That makes sense. Yeah. Because I always, like, I'm very, uh... <laughs> I'm very neurodivergent. So, like, I, uh... I don't like it when people like professors explain things in complicated ways. I'm like, there's an easy way to explain this, and that's the correct way we should be explaining it. <laughs> and then I just do that. My typing skills. <laughs> it's so fine. Normally I'm a little bit better about understanding what people, because I also make so many typos all the time. But when I'm streaming, I'm like reading it like while I'm doing other stuff, and I'm like, what? This is for Ellie. And then this is also for Ellie. There we go. Oh, and we can do this. Oh yeah. Make that room bigger. We'll make the kitchen bigger. Ah, it's gonna be great. We're gonna have to put an oxygen thing up here at some point though. Because there is not going to be enough oxygen over here. I think part of it too is just not over condensing material and letting students do some of that. Maybe filter it, but don't distill it entirely. Hmm. Yeah, I, I think there is like a real... Especially if you don't recommend a book. I think there's a real... Uh importance to like having students have their own understanding of stuff you know so like if they like a certain way of thinking about things then letting them have that and there are a lot of professors who are really weird about like not doing that and i'm like that's you're just being inefficient you're straight up just being inefficient at this point like Okay, I do need to block this side off for right now, I think. Or do I? I don't really know what I would want to put over there. I guess we could put ranching stuff over there at some point. We're gonna have power over here. This whole area, I'm gonna open this up. And then... yeah. I think I'm just gonna deconstruct this wall. And we'll start by doing that. People think in ways natural to them. Other people's thoughts don't stick with them if you don't resonate with them personally. Oh yeah. Well, and I think for me, I, in terms of like learning and stuff, I'm very lucky in the sense that like I can kind of, uh, I can, I can usually understand what people want like pretty well. Um, if I just make this an airlock, it wouldn't really be an issue, but I kind of do want this to be base area. I don't know what I want, though. That's eh, fine for now. I'll probably make this an airlock. Yeah. Um, yeah, so I, you know, I can teach, I can kind of learn in any way that a professor teaches, but a lot of times it's just like, man, you're not doing this well for other people. <laughs> like, that's, that's usually the the sticker. Oh, look at them. They're all so happy. Half the struggle. Once you know what someone wants and that's defined, you're halfway there. Yeah. It sucks, though, when classes become, like, trying to figure out what the professor wants you to do instead of, like, just doing the class. Like, man. That's not learning. That's just doing your stupid you class. <laughs> I'm just here to learn the content. I don't care about, like, what you... I mean... 
I don't really care about like what the professor, you know, wants. I just want to learn. I think some people would be like, you can't say that. <laughs> That's blasphemy. You have to, the professor's always right. It's like, I'm the professor and I'm wrong. You don't want to be fighting the professor for the material. Yeah. That's so much of, uh, so much of engineering for, for me. Is that? We need to be harvesting enough calories per person per day, I think. That's the ideal. But mushrooms will help with that. Professors are wrong all the time. Yeah. I'm not looking forward to my fluids professor. He... Oh, he's made the worst impression already. I I'm very much like... I like people. I like understanding people. And I think like to like learning, you kind of have to like understanding people. It's kind of impossible to like do well in learning without that. But my god, are there some people who are just like so wrong about things that you're like, how do I... <laughs> how do I... How do we do this? How do we have a back and forth? Ooh, textile loom. I don't know. That's exciting. Not only big things, but they make little mistakes. Yeah, but it depends on the little mistakes because some people will make mistakes and they'll they'll be like, oh, it's just a little mistake. And I'm like, mm, but the time you made it at or the way you made it was so important that like it actually is a kind of big mistake, you know? I'm gonna make some airflow tiles here, I think. Just so that all that carbon dioxide can can run out. Because there is some carbon dioxide coming in here. They forget what it's like to be learning something basic. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh wait, I need to build an airlock there. <laughs> For me, it's, it's weird because, like, it's not even that- I don't think you have to remember what it's like to be learning something basic. If you just teach it in a basic way, you'll never, you'll never, you know, have that issue. Like, because if I'm like, oh, well, I'm just going to teach calculus and, like, we're going to make this simple, then... You know, it doesn't matter that I learned it a long time ago. A derivative is still a derivative. Obviously, they've never seen it before, but, you know, it's just an instantaneous rate of change. At that moment, how much is something changing? That's all it, that's all it is. It's not about teaching it in a basic way. It's about not... It's about... It's not about... But it's not about intentionally being obtuse. Yeah, I think for me, it's just my philosophy is that, like... And I think some people would disagree, but I, I do think that, like, all of engineering and all of math and stuff is actually not hard. It's just, like, doing it is the hard part, but understanding it and being able to relate to it is not hard. Sort of talking to, like, a child as if they were a baby versus as they were adult. Hmm. Yeah, that's interesting. It's like, you don't want to, you definitely don't want to, like, um, oh, what's the word? Uh, like, patronize people, <laughs> you know? Um, not, not, but I don't see, uh, things being simple as things being dumb. <laughs> but that's just me also liking efficiency, because, like, I think that, you know, you can, you can read a textbook and you can see, like, the textbook saying, like, well, I'm using all these big words, and, uh, because I need to sound like a textbook, and we have a, you know, a relationship where you are the reader of a textbook, and I am the textbook, and so I have to sound this way. And it's like, yeah, but, but through that, you're communicating so much worse. Like, and I just would rather you say, like, you know, less words that are more simple. <laughs> just get to the point right away. Um, but that that's also sort of like, it's... It's a really interesting thing, I think, within textbooks or within the way the professors lecture also. Like, on how, you know, how, um, not even verbose, but how, how they speak, you know? Interesting, interesting questions. I 
think. So, wow, this is taking a long time. I don't know why it's taking... Oh, it's because it's Nisbet. Why is Nisbet building that? It's like... Is it because they're standing on a ladder? Like... <laughs> He's going to be deconstructed. Maybe it's because the other people are building something else. I don't know. Who knows? Where's Pei? I swear to God if Pei's down there. He's not down there. Thank God. But I wouldn't put past Pei to be down there. Where is Pei? Oh, Pei's right there. Okay. Really confused about why Nisbet was doing that. Uh, does Nisbet have a priority in building? Accidentally? No, she doesn't. She just is doing it. That is weird. Attacking. Okay, we don't need to attack anything, so that's fine. Oh, it's almost done. There we go. Um, I will put an oxygen thing up there. Okay. Let's think. So now we got this done. This is all opened up. There's carbon dioxide up here. Great. There's a lot of carbon dioxide up there. Um. Hmm. How do we want to do this? Because there's a lot of carbon dioxide in both here and here. And this is certainly not um, correcting for it enough. I think we need to do this. I think we need to build some tiles down here. Build this one first, just in case. Deconstruct all these ones. Uh, deconstruct this stuff. Actually, let me take a look on the power overlay. Whoops, that's temperature. Don't know why I clicked that one. Yeah, deconstruct that stuff. And plumbing... Where's plumbing? Yeah, just the above ground ones. The other ones can stay. We might need to plumb something in there at some point. And... I'm gonna put some batteries in there. And I'm gonna move the generator up there also. And I think that will be good. Because right now, yeah, this is going well. We're not producing mush bar anymore, which I don't really know if that's... Let me see. I just want to make sure that we're not, like, if we have nothing, then we won't. Yeah, it might be, like... Next order, no workable order. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Check temperatures too. Oh my god, sorry. I keep like flash bombing. Flash banging. Oh, okay. Someone's already going in the water to do that. They just love going in the water so much, guys. Please. Okay, there we go. Okay, well, uh, I mean, <laughs> it's not the worst it could be, I guess. I don't even know if I can mop it is the thing. I would like it to be mopped. Because obviously we can't put, like, If there's water, I don't want them to build these either yet. Or here at least, just cause like it's gonna, you know, go everywhere. That's a moppable. That's a moppable amount. Oh, they're gonna get stuck. <laughs> Lol. Deconstruct that. And deconstruct this. Oh, and there's carbon dioxide. Yeah, this is... Man, unsafe working environments. My colony just lo just loves getting in there. Wait, did I not order these people? You guys are...
Oh, I think I might have accidentally deconstructed a power thing. No, I didn't. What? Ah! Why did she do that? Oh my god, can you do this one first, please? Oh god, okay. Oh, that's stupid. Oh, I, I did a dumb. It's like an independent variable? Oh, like in, um... Just like in anything? Or like what's, what? This is bad. Why did I put water in here? Like, an independent variable is in statistic eat? health? Statistic health. I don't know if this is just like health statistics. Um, well, like, an independent variable is something that is going to change other variables. I mean, generally. I would assume it's probably the same um, type of deal with whatever you're you're dealing with. It's just like the general term. Same thing as, as dependence in linear algebra. Uh, it depends on how, like, how mathy is it. Because sometimes it might just be it might just be referring to a variable that's that's changing other variables. So like, you might say, you know, um, the temperature is an independent variable which affects uh, you know people going outside, right? Like if people will go outside. But if it's like an independent, yeah, generally that's what it'll be. So like your your x will be your independent variable and your y will be your dependent variable if your y is defined as a function of x. Am I familiar with nominal? Is it a software or are we just talking about like nominal values? Because again, it's just it's just a word. Oh, this is so nice. Look at this. Got a big room just for power. And we've got a bunch of ladders over there that don't go anywhere. Oops. <laughs> they left a big hole in the ground. That's fine. In statistics? Um, yeah, an, like a nominal value? Or is it a... Wait, let me look. Oh my gosh. I haven't saved this whole time. Holy moly. Okay. Um, nominal. Statistics. Yeah. Nominal. I mean, like, I know what a nominal value is. <laughs> a nominal statistic is, is like a label, I guess. I mean, what I, what I know, like a nominal value is, uh, the value that something is. You know, so like, if you have your, if you have a tolerance, or if you have like an uncertainty on it, your nominal value is like, let's say you, you measured six eggs, but you didn't count, well, six is kind of dumb. You measured 20 eggs, and you're not like, you know, you're saying that you might have counted one egg off in either direction, so your 20 would be your nominal value, and then it'd be 20, like, plus or minus one egg. But I don't know if that's that, either. I think I'm going to make... This is so tall. Why did I make this so tall? I guess I could make two rooms, low-key. Make two floors. This is like the worst height, because you can't have three. <laughs> you can have two in it, too. I guess I could just make some battery packs down here, and then have all the generator stuff up there. Oh, yeah. Let, let, wait, I can check that out. Yes, let's go. Long commutes? Who's commuting long times? Everybody. Or no. Cook supply. Ah, cook supply is bad. Okay, well... Let me sort that out. Variables like GPA can utilize different levels of measurement. Give an example of how you could create a variable for GPA using each level of measurement. Okay, level of measurement. So this is not an engineering statistics thing. This is just a regular ass statistics thing. So nominal 
val nominal measurement statistics. It describes a variable with categories that do not have a natural order or ranking. So it's sort of like um, a... Here, let me send an image. I never did this stuff. This is not, this is not stuff that they cared about for us because we only ever worked with like numbers. Um, we didn't work with like, okay, I mean, you're working with numbers. It's not like you're not working with numbers, but that I think is what they mean. So one nominal just categorizes and labels variables. The other one ranks categories in an order an interval has known equal intervals, and then a ratio is a true or meaningful zero. Now, do I know how I could apply that to GPA? Um, I'm trying to think. GPA, oh nice, attribute increase. Hell yeah. How are we doing on oxygen? It looked good, it looked good when I opened it up for two seconds. Up here's bad. That's okay. We'll have to add a, an oxygen thing up there. Oh, we're we're gonna do the power, and then we can then we can do the oxygen. I think some of the carbon dioxide has leaked down into here and made it worse over here. Bad, but <laughs> it's okay for our purposes. Ooh, we're back. We're almost at 100k calories. It's crazy. And to think we started off with like 27. Yeah, so I'm gonna put the I'll put the generators down here and the other ones. Student name can be nominal. Um, yeah, I think so. You could probably also do it by. Oh, she's gonna fall. Please don't die. Oh no, she's smart. Uh, you could also maybe do it- well, I think it would be, uh, what was the other one that they called it? What was that? One that started with an O that I already forgot, because I don't have to remember it. Ordinal. I think you could say, like, you know, A, B, C, D, F. That could be, like, an ordinal thing. I'm not sure, though. I'm gonna I'm gonna build some tiles up here. We're gonna do here, and then build this out this way, and put batteries here because I want to have. Oops, sorry, not batter, not regular batteries. Pfft. Shaw, I laugh at your batteries. We'll do three. And then we can have one that goes... I guess it would be smart. How tall is this thing? It's three tall. God damn it. Uh, okay, if I put it here... We'll put it up top there. I think... I think I can do this. I'm just gonna leave this one going and we're just gonna build all this and then uh, it's fine. <laughs> and then this front room can be something else, I guess. New printables. Whoa. Ooh, ice. That would be bad, I think. Hatchling eggs are good. They excrete solid coal. We can't really take on a dupe right now. We don't really need another dupe either. Oh, that's cute. I think hatch hatchling eggs. I mean, they're just gonna incubate, but you know. Yeah, we definitely need to do something about the water supply for sure. Because people are spending too long to do that. Oh shit, they're actually going and doing this stuff too. How's the natural gas situation over here? 
Oh, yes, the second airlock really helped, I think. Oh, that gives me peace of mind. I mean, I know it takes them, like, way longer to travel doing that, but... Oh, they're not building that, though, huh? How are they doing priority fours before this stuff, which is priority five? I guess I should just make this priority five. As long as they're not burning to death, I'm actually not worried. I'm surprised they're not really hot, because it's very hot. Oh god, get out of there. Major eye irritation. Guys. Whatever. Um. Yeah. Going. Where are they? Where are you? Where are you? Deconstruct the ladder. Oh, okay, they're doing that stuff. I think we can probably turn these off now. Oh, let me have a switch. Let me make a switch there. My mouse is really, uh, dissenting. Okay, we'll put it there. That means I need to go into the power. And then... do wire... Wait a switch. Yeah. I'm gonna make sure I was doing the right thing. Just so we can just, like, turn those off without having to, you know, worry. Why is he doing that? I don't know. Very confusing, the, the priorities of these, these dupes sometimes. I think I'll probably do this cycle and one more, and then we'll 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 pause. This is good. Oh, nice! They're building. Them. Oh, I can turn it off. Whoa! I didn't realize I can turn it off. I thought I had to... Holy moly. I get to do that. Okay. Who cares about automation then? I'll just put switches everywhere. That's what I thought I-, I that's what I thought- that's what I thought I remember automation being. Lol. Lol, even. That's crazy. Oh no. Nisbet is- Oh, poor thing. High irritation. I think maybe there would be another big ladder here, but it wouldn't go all the way down. It would just go to here, I guess. Maybe I'll do that. Well, not that it really needs to happen anytime soon, but yeah, so we'll have both of these feed in. Now I can make the, I can make this, which is great. Full generator here. Okay, now we get to pause and we get to look at how we want to split things. So, in this, the way that we're going to split it would be... So this is connected to this, these are connected to this, that's our, that's our power, and this is our main power line. So... To do that, am I just like, is there... Oh, do we have a transformer? Or not yet? Because I think if I power the transformers, then... 
I can safely split up power lines. Because the way that I would have to do it now would be having that like that, and then having this go up, which I could also do. Maybe I just do that. Let's do that for now. So, wait, but wouldn't that, that would still be all on the same circuit. I feel like, I feel like it is all on the same circuit. If they're all connected. Yeah, like, this is still on the same circuit. <laughs> okay. I'm, I'm a silly guy. Let me get a transformer. Where, where are transformers? That would be in, maybe in... Power. Advanced power. Yeah. Yeah. Prevents wires from drawing more than a thousand watts. Okay. Yeah, we gotta do that. What is this thing? Power shutoff. Oh, I forgot. Automation is not really, like, what, um... Yeah. Large power transformer. No, we just need the little ones. Okay, so we'll do power. So, I guess it, that means we're not really too bad on power right now. We just kind of... I'm probably going to leave this going the way it is then. And we'll have to... I think I'm probably just going to get rid of a lot of the power stuff. And then... Like... Um, and then, what was I going to say? I will redo the grid, because I don't know if I like this grid. And we'll put a bunch of switches to stuff that, you know, may or may not need switches. Yeah, like, I want this go through the floor. This should always be on, but, like, this should have a switch, you know, stuff like that. I think that's maybe how I can do it too, like, if I section this off with, like, a switch, then that's sort of like having it on a different, like, line, quote-unquote, because, like, I can turn it off if it's gonna overload. Not that that really is what happens. <laughs> but... Maybe I should start thinking about making rooms too. Barracks. One or more beds, no industrial machinery. Miscellaneous room, enclosed by wall tile. Yeah, so I think we need to make some of these room rooms. Like, if I put a door right here, I think this can be a barracks. Maybe. Isn't it a pneumatic door? Kind of silly, because we have, like, a weird medical thing spread out across two things. I don't know. But. And I don't like that it's not very tall. Maybe we'll move down the mess hall? Wait, but the mess hall's three. This is four, and that's two. Two, three, four. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, this size of building is just bad. I don't know why I built it like that. I mean, I guess it's actually okay for this, but... Don't listen. Don't listen to me. <laughs> Notters. Wait, who is the highest stress? Why are they stressed? Yucky lungs. Low oxygen. Oh. Yeah, over there it's not great, huh? It's max gas pressure, though. It's just because there's carbon dioxide. It's not because it's... Oh, diagnosis. Yeah, it's 82% breathable. I mean... It's just not spread out well. <laughs> kind of a weird way of thinking about it. Wait, so is this a, is this a room room? Oh, it is! Morale bonus! Let's go! That's awesome! 
Oh, that's great. Luxury barracks. One or more comfy beds. No cots. Let's go. So if I move the stuff from the mess hall, then that means that it's going to be a mess hall too. Hmm. Well, I have to put a door here. That's kind of bad. The central storage thing is... Eh. It's kind of hard because we don't have any central storage. I guess the smartest thing to do would be to put it here, huh? Maybe move the med bay. <laughs> we don't really have a med bay. <laughs> move it up here. Or down here. But I think I want to put refinement stuff down here. Okay. At night we'll pause, we'll set up some stuff, and then we'll do the last cycle. <gasps> oh. Hey, we're still pretty good. We're in the green for... for calories. Everybody ate. Good, good, good. Yes! 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 1,000k cal! Let's go! That's so hype. Ooh, Ellie, there's a lot of cooking supply. Yeah, construction supply, cooking- oh well. They did not do that stuff. That's fine. Okay, let's see. So I do want to put refinement down here. That's- let's do that. Uh, refinement? This is where our rock crusher will be. Well, I won't worry about the power right now, but that's where that'll be. Med bay will be moved up here. Or could be, you know, or could be over here. Is this is sort of our airlock, but that's oh, that's okay that that's our airlock up there. It doesn't really affect it. So, because I mean, there's a lot of stuff that I that I have for medical stuff that doesn't even really work. Wall. So three three is good good height I think. That and then we'll put a manual airlock here. Just because this is not ready to be base yet. So, like, we'll have the, the triage cot. Uh, actually, let's start with... Where is it? Um, medicine, wash basin first. Ooh, a sink. Hmm. Interesting. No, we're, we're poor. We gotta do the wash basin. Apothecary will go, like, right there. And then we'll do a sick bay. And then we'll do the triage cop. There. And we can, you know, deconstruct all this stuff. Nobody's gotten hurt yet, luckily. We can't even do this. Oh, I guess we can technically do that. But we don't need to use the hand sanitizer. That one can go away. The water in the water cooler. Uh, we can make a rec room maybe somewhere at some point. Is there any slime lung up there? Nah, we're good. Nah, we're good. And look, there's so much less germ germs down there. There's a bit around the colony, this looks like. But... Oh wait, no. That's zero. Wow. That's cool. We're doing well. I wonder if the decor in there is better now. No, it's bad, but it's because of all the stuff on the floor. <laughs> oh, this is... Deconstruct these. Yeah, I think it's fine. I mean, there's some polluted oxygen up there, but like, it's nothing too bad. Not gonna let me... Do that tile. There we go. Yay! Oh, is there actually like a lot of polluted on our farm? That's fine. And the polluted auction though, like this, that's kind of dumb. 
I mean, they are right by the algae diffusers, so... Or they, they're, there's a deodorizer right there, but, like, ideally... I mean, I guess I could get a sweepy. I feel like if maybe if we get a sweepy, then we can kind of... We can kind of do a little better in that area. Yeah, let's see. Wait, what are we researching? Is, do we have nothing to research? Oh, we're getting there. Oh, Nisbet's just working on this one. Oh, it needs water. We're close on that research. Oh yeah, we can like upgrade the kitchen next too with like an electric grill, an egg cracker. No, I don't think we need an egg cracker. I think we got a. I wonder if this is the hydroponic farm. I wonder if that's like more, if it's faster. <sighs> Research complete, exactly what I wanted. Oh my god. Then we could do transformers. So we'll just have like two. Essentially. Those will be our two lines. One for like important systems, and then the other one for uh, everything else. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I think when I built, when I actually did this, I had smart automation so that like when the, oh, they're like generating stuff. That is actually not a smart idea. Okay, well, that's fine, I guess. We kind of need to hook stuff up to power before they do that, but that's fine. Which one is the in and which one's the out? Uh, Ooh, has decayed. Uh oh. I guess like this and this. Oh, well, these wires don't need to be here. Whoops. These wires do not need to be here anymore. And eh, we'll figure it out. That'll be a different cycle issue. And I might just put some thermal insulation. I'm a little... I mean, I'm a little not super happy that it's like... Oh god. <laughs> they, don't, they didn't dig anything over here. Um, that is right under the food, because it might get too hot. But, you know, we could thermally insulate it, or we could move the stuff, or whatever. Like, we could end up moving it down here and put thermal tiles around it, whatever. I still have Nisbet, like, research this. It's idle. Ooh, that's probably- oh, maybe it's just idle because we haven't researched when its cycles are. Not sure. And then it starts outputting a kajillion heat and- and... killing all of us. <laughs> That's powering most of that. I want to get rid of um, this then. Just for now, so... Oh, these batteries are not connected anymore? Wait, when did that happen? That's bad. Oh. I don't know when those batteries got to- it must have been like during uh, during a, a phase of me deconstructing stuff. <laughs> um, let's see. We should do- what did I say we needed to do? Oh, I kind of want to do a sweepy. Solid and liquid spills. I feel like that's kind of cool. Fuck it, let me ball. 
I am bad at sweeping things and I feel like it would be better to have us like sweep like polluted water and a lot of other stuff. But yeah, so power, let's see. Oops, that's not power. Lol. Um, is this not? It's inactive. Oh, because there's no- oh, I want to put an oxygen generator up there, too. Let's make that priority six so people do it. I was like, why isn't it doing anything? Look at this, we got a little med bay up here. I mean, I don't know if it actually counts as a med bay, because I think it needs to have a certain type of thing going on. Put a door there. We're still good on algae. I guess I should probably put coal on here. Make sure we're not eating through stuff too, too fast. Attribute increase. Nice. Um, what was I going to look at? I was going to look at... Oh, room overlay. Yeah, this is a nothing room because it's not blocked off. Well, for it to be a hospital, medical equipment, toilet, mess table. Hmm. Oh, because somebody has to be able to sleep in there, I guess? Maybe? Uh, uh, I mean, I guess I can put a mess table in there. Pretty easy. Oh, well, they're done now. That's fine. <laughs> All right. I think we're, I think we're pretty good. Oh wait. Um, none of that stuff is powered. Uh, that's not good. Why? Because this is not powering stuff. Uh oh. Well, we'll have to figure that out. Maybe I. I think maybe I flipped the load, the input and the output or something. That is very possible. <laughs> which way did they go in and which way did they go out? Oh, yep. Yep. It it literally has arrows pointing on it. Okay, I'm going to I'm going to deconstruct some stuff first real quick and then we'll So, it would be Ugh, it's kind of nasty. Yeah. Okay, well, stuff will have a little issue, but that's not too bad. Oh, it's so exciting. Is there any any temp issues? Okay, it's a little hot over here, but like not too hot. Whoa, whoa. That's exciting. Comfy bed on a sign. Ooh. Somebody can sleep. Oh, I got really scared that they were going there. Let's see. We got meal ice. Fine. Travel time. A shit ton. Construction supply. It's always construction supply. Definitely got to figure out where to put sweeping stuff and actually making sure this sweep stuff is like accessible somewhere in this level. Also, fire poles will help at some point, but all our all our mat, all our important systems are still on that one, all the older system. So it's okay that the well, the micro busher not being on is bad. But all right, we're gonna save here. Overwrite blur, but the blur bows are doing well. Um, I did not expect to be going for this long, uh, but it was fun to stream for a while. Um, thanks everybody for hanging out. It was it was a great time. Um, really had really had fun. Um, I may stream tomorrow. I probably won't because I have to do a lot of like stuff before I head out on Monday. Um, but you will probably see me doing fluids or linear linear two. Um, so differential equation systems uh, next. And maybe I might do materials. So I have materials, and the other class I have is... What is it? Oh, it's uh, CE207, which is um, Beam Theory 2. So that's like, we get to use linear algebra, which is fun. Eigenvalues, stress values, max stuff. 
Uh, I heard that this professor canceled all of his classes last quarter and only taught two, and they didn't learn anything. So that's a real glowing <laughs> review. <laughs> but hopefully he teaches the classes this time. Um, I don't know. Uh, I'm just gonna say it one more time. All right, I will see you guys later. Thanks for hanging out. Um, yeah, I'll see you when I see you. Bye. Have a great day.